very, very windy out here this evening. This is a, uh, one of the schools around Northwest Ohio. So many have fallen victim to, uh, you know, condensing, consolidating districts. And this one's been closed for a while. I don't know a lot of information about it. I think I'm gonna actually look up a little bit more. It's called the Milton Elementary School. Just by looking at the parking lot, it's evident that not much has been uh, done here for a while. The grass is fairly long. Don't really know who monitors the property or what the status is. Don't really see any no trespassing signs. It has a very, very kind of eerie vibe. Very, very eerie. Very, very eerie. Nice. <laughs> okay, yeah, I know it's almost Halloween. This place would be definitely very creepy at night. Very creepy. Again, I'm not sure of all the, uh, why it is closed, all the details. Looks like there's some, uh, some kind of ponchos or jackets in there. It's hard to see. And you know how people in this area, I don't think they really understand, um, people like me filming stuff. I don't get it. I don't think I'm even gonna try to try the door or anything. I may get nearer the building, but look at the uh, the basketball uh, court. There's a house right across the street with about a hundred no trespassing signs on it, including dogs, pit bulls, in cages. Yeah, this place is sketchy. Very small town. That's what's worse because small towns they to be more aware of this kind of stuff. Wow. Look at this playground. That right there is just so, so interesting to see. Oh, wow. Look at this. It's been, it's been many years since this playground was used. see like how tall the weeds are. The building's condition is pretty good. Old trash. Wow. This is very interesting. Very, very interesting there. I've always wanted to come out here and walk around. I never really got the nerve to do it. I guess because of those dogs across the street. There's no, uh, no trespassing signs on this property. Look at these swings here. Again, I'm kind of far away from the car and I'm rambling, so I'm gonna shut up. Look at the swings. Looks like it's been a long time since anybody has swung on those swings. Here's something interesting I want to bring up. That you can do so many videos and uh, capture so many places and still feel those nerves being at any one. It just, I mean, it's a little bit, because uh, he just, you're not really sure like why the building is the way it is, what the neighbors across the street are thinking, and uh, yeah. Every building, every single location is different, has to be handled differently. I mean, not one of these places is alike. There's similar uh, traits, I guess you could say, but every one of them is a whole new, uh, well, a, a new adventure. But obviously, a whole new animal to attack. This is 
very, very overgrown. There's a bench right there. There's dogs across the street. Barking and barking away. The Milton <coughs> Elementary. Interesting bars in the bottom windows, not really sure why. dogs. Okay, I'm exaggerating. Behind me. Barking. And that wind is crazy. Really crazy wind. Just do one final quick walk up the, uh, the steps. Up the sidewalk. There's your meter. It's quiet. Here's what's a little odd. Right there. Fallout shelter. Really? Why? Look at this. Jesus Christ. I'm, I'm intrigued enough to look inside. Wow. Condition pretty good still. I mean, it's not like it's uh, there's no see, there's no roof damage. It's pretty uh, eerie in there being all closed. A couple things blowing in the breeze there. And we're gonna quickly. I'm, I want to get the hell out of here. Quickly walk around to this side. Those looks like firemen's uniforms. Yeah, those are. Oh, no. The school guard crossing uniforms. I had to quell my curiosity. Very, very, very nerve-wracking here. I don't know why. Very, very ominous. Well, I'll post some more information below. And I'm going to cut it here before I go back into the wind. There's a flag up in the classroom. Sad. Thanks for watching, guys. Catch you later.